how is London different in comparison to Poland as like in terms of know. reaction of people and how you feel in the city? London is very different to, comparing to Poland, you know. The first thing when I've landed here I was like like this, you know, and like, hey nobody's staring at me, nobody's pointing me, you know, nobody's throwing bottles and things like those. And I was like, okay. If London is working for me and for people like like me as well, you know, it's perfect. There's quite a big scene if it comes to Poland modifications, to like goth subculture, gothic subculture and all that kind of things, you know. Alternative like subculture in London is yeah it's really really big compared to Poland, you know. So in Poland you know say somebody slapped me, then people spit it on my dread because they think you don't wash them. Uh, of course yeah there were like also nice situations like people were like appreciating, you know, the thing that I'm doing, you know, that yeah. If it comes to London well, yeah, some, sometimes, you know, some people are saying something, but usually immigrants. I'm immigrant as well, but I respect this country, I respect its culture, you know. And I'm even if I would, I would see somebody who's like totally not in my type, you know, I would be like, okay, fine. You know, it's, it's not my thing. But yeah, sometimes when I'm like coming back in like, like my fetish uh, um, outfits and so, like, you know, rubber cut suit and so, usually Arabic guys are trying to pick me up. Bigger, hairy guys, that's what I love, hey, and beards, and my, my boyfriend has the biggest, well, the biggest, the best beard ever, so hey, yeah, <laughs> it works. <laughs> it took me about six years to get to this stage, you know, yeah, because if it comes to piercings, you can't do everything, you know, at a time, it has to be a like slow process. Meanwhile, I was, yeah, training my makeup skills and so and so, so yeah, about, about six, six years, yeah. How much pain is involved? Do your ears hurt while sleeping? Ears? No. My ears doesn't hurt while, while I'm sleeping. It's Sometimes I, I'm taking the plugs, you know, out. Sometimes I'm sleeping with them, you know. But if it comes to stretching in general, you know, it doesn't hurt if you're doing it really, really slowly. So yeah, if it comes to stretching, no. If it comes to other modifications like yeah, implants, this is quite painful. Even if you're like using anesthetic, tattoos, it depends. Scarifications, yeah. Piercings, not, not very, it's not very painful. How many piercings, implants, and tattoos do you have? I have, well, I have about like 30 piercings, quite a few tattoos, like only here, on my face, on my eyeballs, uh, implants on my forehead, as you can see, then implants on my forearms, on both of them, yeah. Then I have like a three scarification lines in here, uh, tongue split, something like this, you know, like tunnels in my nose, tunnels in my ears, that kind of stuff, yeah. Your eyes, it's ink, no? Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. ink. You have to inject the ink underneath the transparent tissue which covers the eye. You're using a syringe and it's a really, really tiny needle. Basically, yeah, I've done it on, yeah, on myself, on my own, yeah. Well, it was kind of tricky to do it, like... Isn't it dangerous? Some... Yeah, <laughs> you can get blind if you, like, pierce it, you know, if you, like, get, like, yeah. too deep. Were you yeah. scared? No, no, you can't be scared to do it, otherwise your hand will shake and then basically, the, you know, the risk is, is bigger.